Um, yeah, I am from Central Ohio. I live in Columbus, Ohio. Um, and I want to talk about Move to Mend and why I support it. But first, let me preface my reasons for my support for Move to Mend by asking a question to anyone who, to everybody who's listening. How else are we going to have a democracy that works without getting to the roots of why democracy is not working in this country? That's what Move to Mend does. We get at the roots. I don't see how the current situation is sustainable without a constitutional amendment that, that puts people before corporations. I don't see how this country can continue on the way we think it should be or want it to be or whatever, unless we have people before corporations. Think about it. How many requests do you get? Do you personally, just think about it, do you get for donations to in charities that you support? Maybe you've supported for a long time. Important foundations and group that do good work around the country, around the world. Friends, family, and even strangers in need. How many times they come with, come to ask you for some, hey, can you, you know, get spare a dime? Um, I heard that GoFundMe is now one of the largest saviors of people go, from going into debt with, um, over health matters. Some of you may also be juggling schedules to attend rallies, marches, lectures, films, and fundraisers and other events. All worthwhile actions that we need to do, want to do, but wouldn't have to do if democracy worked in this country. I mean, why are we going out and saying, hey, don't separate those parents from those children. Hey, um, let's let's um, have a talk, a, a discussion on fracking or the environment or whatever. No, we don't have these things. So one of the things I really like about Move to Men is that our focus is on ensuring that the people are deciding the policies rather than what those policies are. Um, I have, I want people in the driver's seat because I have faith in the people. The vast majority of us are for basic human common sense policies. So great. We're in, we have a consensus on this. Wonderful. So are, polit are, are politicians working on these issues? Cer certainly they are, right? Ha. Across the country, state, local, and federal officials are instead rolling out bills that none of us have asked for. Voter suppression laws, anti-protest bills. Um, you have government state of you have state of government officials passing laws to deny its working class people a few more bucks. Um, bucks that don't even come from state coffers, but from the federal government. But they don't want to give them up to the working poor. Um, Shouldn't they be working on getting everyone food, housing, health care, safe water, air and soil, and hey, even broadband? I mean, it's communications. They should, but they are not. And to protect the privileges of doing so, they are hot on bills to gerrymander districts, suppress votes, and, and arrest those who disagree with them. While they are doing that, I get more requests for more donations and for more meetings and rallies and other actions over issues that should not be issues and would not be if the people were in charge. Americans want all people, whether whether they agree with us or not, to have the opportunity to speak our minds, vote for their preferred candidates, and live without fear of want, harm, or injustice of any sort. This is why I don't think what's going on, the current situation is sustainable, and why I think we need move to men. I'll continue being involved with other issues because we need to be out there. But I do not see this, as I said, sustainable. Not against billionaires and zillionaires who keep making even more money every time you turn around. Um, and, and what do they do with that money? They buy the media, government, school, financial industries. And you want to complain? They also have the courts. Makes no sense. That's why we're, that's why we're going along with this. So I'm for Move to Men because it gets the reasons for the current situation, one that is unsustainable. Something has to give. I'm putting my money on the people and into move to men to make that happen.